You guys, I forgot to put on sunscreen this morning. I literally left the house in such a rush. I was driving and I was like, oh my God, I forgot to put on sunscreen. And if you know something about me, because I just got my carnelian. By the way, my skin looks so good. Except for the acne, but anyway. You're not supposed to be in the sun without sunscreen after you get my carnelian. Today we're going to focus on getting my life together. I have been feeling an overwhelming amount of joy lately. Number one, and I have to say it right off the get-go. Thank you everybody for all the love you've been showing my show. My show, my episode on Noche de Pendejadas. Wow, am I overwhelmed. Can I have this salted caramel cream cold brew? I have a granny salted cream cold brew. My friend Natasha is going to help you out the window and it's 525. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. Oh my gosh, she was so sweet. I love when people love their job and they just like, they're in a good mood. Como que se pega, verdad? You guys, I want to, I'm done being basic. Like, I don't want to be basic anymore. <laughs> um, I'm still traumatized by when Blanca ordered her. Oh my God, let me show you my address. I'm still traumatized by when Blanca ordered Starbucks drinks from YouTubers. I haven't even watched that video because I'm terrified that I was the most basic one. So Blanca, if you're watching this, I'm sorry. When you do the video again, I, I will do better, girl. I will do better. We're getting Starbucks because today we're gonna focus on getting my life together. I have been in a lot of trips and by a lot of trips, I mean two. I went to Arizona twice this last month and the house is a mess. Not only is the house a mess, but when my house is a mess, I just feel like not clean. I don't feel cute. I don't feel put together. Like no matter what I look like, it just doesn't feel good to come home to a dirty house. That's number one. Number two, look at this atrociousness. <gasps> oh my God. Que horror. Que horror. Story time. I was closing my fridge this morning after feeding my dogs. And I went to go close it like this. And my fridge has French doors. And so this door was like this. And so when I went to go close it, it nipped at my nail and it literally snapped in half. That's the scary news. The good news is that it didn't hurt. It literally ended up cutting like right above where my actual nail would be. So it didn't cut any of like my skin off. But if you remember, I was already thinking of sh like cutting my nails shorter last time that I came and I kept them long and I feel like that's a sign for me to just cut them short do short square nails and go nude. I love these nails, these nails are cute and all, but I want to feel short, classy, and cute again. I feel like these got too long, they got too bright, um, you know, the under nails kept bothering me, so we're gonna go get our nails done right now. Houston, we have a broken nail, I have to go get my nails done. Yay! Oh my God, we're gonna try it right now. Mmm. She's definitely strong. She's also definitely salted. I saw that somebody said on my last video when I tried the Panera coffee, they were like, honestly, I love you, Stacey, but I know that everything you try, you'll say it's good. So I'm sorry, you guys. I'm not a coffee reviewer. Don't take my word for it. I'll drink anything. I'm not picky when it comes to food. Okay, so here are my nails again. Before we get off, I wanted to show them to you. Here is the nail of horror. We're gonna go short, square, and nude today. Just classic short vibes. We'll see how they do because we are at a nail shop. I'm scared. Short, square nails can sometimes look not nice, but it's a time of desperation right now. We must make something happen. What do you think? <gasps> Oh my God, I actually think she did an amazing job. The color I ended up going with is like this almost pasty white nude. So I feel like it kind of looks white, but you could also tell it's like a nudish tone. Because look, this is it compared to white. Like it doesn't look the same as white, you know? She did an amazing job with the shape. I did tell her to make them a little bit thinner. So maybe she was like, okay, I'm just going to make them thin as hell. But that's the thing about this nail shop. This nail shop that I found, th thankfully so far, they always do a good job. I give it a 10 out of 10. I feel so fresh, so chic, and so like elegant with like short square nails. So this was definitely the right thing to do because you guys, honestly, if I'm missing a nail or if I have a nail broken, I just don't feel good about myself like honestly that's what it is i don't like it so i'm glad to have this part this part done for today now the next part of my day is we have to clean we have to do laundry there's a lot of things to do also today we're actually going to be going to jen's house because we're celebrating her birthday so you, let me just show you we'll start off with something easy i wanted to give her like a cute little gift i ended up making her this basket so i just got a bunch of things that i thought she would like um there is a candle a coffee mug that reminds me of her all of these things remind me of her so this one says keep life simple there's some lemon macaroons and then here there's a little cuadrito que dice 
spread a little sunshine everywhere you go because Jen's literally like a ray of sunshine. I got her some little Tupperware because she loves to meal prep. And I got her some chocolates. Y aquí hay un sign de bombones que dice happy birthday. So it's a little gift basket I made her. Se me hizo bien bonito. Let me actually show you the truth behind the scenes of the dirtiness that is our house right now. Honestly, it is what it is. It's the truth. So let's show you. This is the living room. The living room is probably a... 2 out of 10, not that bad, not that dirty. Now the room, oh my God, I'm literally showing, les estoy enseñando mis verdades. So a lot of this clothes, like look, I still have a maleta here. This is so embarrassing to show you, but I still have a maleta here from when we went to Arizona and I just have to put this stuff away. No tení la cama because ya sabía que nos íbamos a ir, so I have to work on that. This is the restroom. It just needs a little bit of upkeeping. Thankfully, my office is not that bad. Um, I keep this, this space pretty clean because this is where I work and where I'm at the majority of the time. But an area that really needs a lot of work is our comedor porque cuando llegamos de camping esta última vez, literal, dejamos nuestras maletas aquí and we haven't worked on putting any of this stuff away. I'm gonna make myself something to eat real quick, voy a comer, and then I'm just gonna work on doing laundry, cleaning, and basically getting the house tidy and pretty. For breakfast, I'm having yogurt. It's Greek yogurt from Costco with some raspberries, which are my favorite. Shout out to Rosa porque me regaló esta tacita de café from Mazatlán. Qué bonita y está enorme, ahí la veo. something very special um well first of all i ended up cleaning la cocina i have some laundry washing still the living room and stuff our room as well but i also got a little bit of help from my husband so i can take all the credit look at how gorgeous these are you guys oh my god so if you've been watching me for a long time you know that denny is like the expert and flowers like genuinely if your husband or your partner wants to get you flowers and you guys are in the LA area tell Danny to tell you where he gets them because he always gets the most beautiful flowers look at these se luce Lenny la verdad you guys look at this we're gonna put them in the vase right now meanwhile we go to Jen's theme I always like to have fresh flowers if you want flowers and your husband and your partner your boyfriend or whatever is like oh they're too expensive I don't want to get you that you guys, flowers at Costco are only like $20, literal, for like una docena o dos. And they're so pretty and they last a really long time. No excuse, girlies. You know, because I do know that there's some girls that genuinely don't like to get flowers. Can't relate, I'm not one of them. Pero, pues se los respeta. El respeto al derecho ajeno es la paz. ¿Quién decía así? Emiliano Zapata. Benito Juarez. They are, there's like a bunch of different bouquets put together. That's how they make them look the stick. The trick is in getting them out but not really moving them too much because then if you move them too much then they'll lose their pretty shape. I think all the rubber bands are off. We grab like this. I don't think there's any more rubber bands. I hope not. Man, I got this vase from Home Goods. So once it's in like this you just let them go. Wow. <laughs> Look at how gorgeous these look. Oh, este se cayó, se rompió. We'll put it like this. Oh my God, these are so gorgeous. Ta-da! This is where the flowers ended up. 
right under our wedding portrait but okay before we go i wanted to show you my outfit because i did change so i put on this dress this dress is from a store called lily Fool, and they're a little bit pricey but it's from last season i don't know if they'll still have it my bag is the designer bag from Black jewel which you could still get it's still available and i have my sperry's on because i haven't gotten a pedicure if you know i get my pedicures with petties by betty and she is fully booked so i missed my last appointment and she was like sorry girl can't see you till seven weeks and he was gonna come with us but he's gonna stay to take a little nap before we go i asked him i was like are you sure you want to stay he's like yeah i'll catch up with you right now thankfully jen doesn't live that far from us so he'll catch up in like no time let's get everything we need you know what else just got here we're gonna see how Jen reacts right now with her gift. I'm so excited to give it to her. And then, una vez lo voy a dar esta botellita de Stella Rose. It doesn't go with the gift, but you know, just to not come empty handed to the party. So let's go and I'll show you guys how she reacts right now. 